Hi guys, welcome to the channel. Quick general reading for my friends Pisces, Sun, Moon, Arising and Venus. Whenever you watch this, take what resonates and leave what doesn't. If you resonate, let us know. Like, share and subscribe to the channel. Thank you for the support. So guys, let's find out what messages want to come through for you. Pisces, Sun, Moon, Arising and Venus in the love arena. Let's see what we can get for you guys in this quick love reading. Right, you get three cards. So quite a combination. Um, all that glitters here and now and mending energy. The all that glitters is an encouragement to pay attention to all the details involved in a situation. Because something may be a little bit different from what it seems. in order to recognize if there is a, a difference, there is a facade in front of something, we need to be present in the moment, here and now, paying attention to what is uh, around us. And this can be the... Um, positive thing to do in order to uh, resolve some issue. Mending is an energy about healing. This can be what can be achieved. It doesn't uh, mean that um, it can be easy, but if it is necessary to do so, it has to be done. So, let's see what the Tarot has to say about these uh, peculiar energies for Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. Here we go. That energy, Ten of Pentacles, the High Priestess. The magician, bottom of the deck, manifesting a revolutionary change. This can be about um, a couple of scenarios. One definitely um, linked to the chance To leave behind a connection and the other one is quite the opposite so the opportunity to move closer and closer towards uh, an established partnership the first thing guys is offered by the uh, presence of the magician and the high priestess because there is a higher level of manifestation strengthened by an intuitively guided power the high priestess knows everything but she speaks only the essentials she is in touch with the higher world the one that we cannot see but the one that we can feel if we pay the right amount of attention and the magician is the powerful manifester that can make the best out of all the tools that he has at his disposal and he is the one with the higher vision he can see opportunities where other individuals cannot see anything so the revolutionary change that comes with the death card can work as a change that can free some of you from an ongoing connection and on the other hand can bring some of you towards a commitment 
this will depend on how much this all that glitters energy is involved in the situation the ten of pentacles is a a beautiful energy by itself legacy a family opportunity a partnership built on solid ground an auspicious scenario that can take care of all the needs involved in the situation but I will do this I will pull the uh, magician energy and bottom of it we have a wish granted nine of cups and I will go for the clarification so that we can move faster towards the understanding of the two scenarios that are offered within this combination because the old glitters all right ace of cups nine of swords two of pentacles and ace of wands bottom of the deck so absolutely two um two different scenarios one is a source of struggles and overwhelming emotions the one that can see a committed already ongoing a commitment already ongoing because we get the nine of swords anxiety sleepless nights monkey mind going left and right so the mind is working against us because there is something off something is missing within a connection there is the necessity to uh, embrace a powerful introspection to take notice of what is not working two of pentacles energy we have a loop the infinite symbol and rough waters behind the man attention is needed in order to resolve a situation that is keeping us stuck we need to break the cycle in order to move forward with the following stages of the journey otherwise uh, we are not going anywhere the revolution is heart driven because it seems that a connection committed may have expired its course and the death energy will sweep away all the leftovers from the past in order to leave an open field on an energy level so that those that are called to power through this situation can manifest something new more in alignment with their wishes nine of cups energy that we have seen healing will be crucial but something was not as it seemed to be and a powerful awareness can be achieved or has been achieved depending on your timelines the ace of wands is a brand new spark that can be manifested moving forward the other scenario guys is quite the opposite again because it can offer the chance to leave behind struggles and anxiety about the fact that a person may not be able to find the proper ten of pentacles partnership opportunity but because of the powerful energy offered by the a priestess some of you may have the chance to interact with a special person and you will be able to face the old that glitters energy meaning 
pay attention to all the factors involved in this interaction so that you can be sure about the fact that the connection is healthy, the connection is balanced, fair, respectful between the both of you, your values and possibly also those of your special person are respected and taken into consideration in the proper way so you will have the chance to cut through the veil of let's say confusion let's say indecision that we can find in the olded glitters energy in order to do that you will have the chance to make the best out of the present time this can be the opportunity to heal and ease energies that may have been tested in the past a source of anxiety a source of uh, doubts you know overthinking things for example will i be able to find the person for me so that i can build up a ten of pentacles uh, partnership these kind of uh, questions may have taken place in this second scenario but then as soon as your intuition the ability to pay attention to what truly matters will pay off we have ace of cups and ace of wands that can be manifested so the ace of cups is a beautiful and pure energy it starts from within it is about mastering self-love leaving behind the anxiety and trying instead to shine your brightest light as soon as a person has mastered love towards themselves they can be able to share this beautiful energy with a special someone it will be a revolution because a situation as it was before will be completely different moving forward a bright and auspicious new beginning a spark of passion that can truly be the opportunity that you may have wished for you will have the chance to manifest it with the magician power leaving behind the struggles because you were able to see the things for what they truly are so these energies king of wands bottom of the ace so taking action in both the scenarios guys these energies are offering two scenarios that are different but there is the same meaningful introspection that can lead towards inner growth and even the scenario that may um, offer the conclusion of a committed connection can even turn out to be the typical blessing in disguise because the death energy as a revolution is intuitively guided with the a priestess it is uh, driven by the ace of cups so inner love pure love and the magician will make sure that those of you that can resonate with the first scenario will have the chance to move towards nine of cups energy a different wish in a different scenario after a meaningful healing has taken place so in the first scenario uh, not all that glitters is gold I think that is the saying and um, I feel that uh, this is definitely the case the second scenario is about an auspicious opportunity to move closer towards a committed partnership after uh, a certain amount of doubts past related about the real chance to fulfill this kind of wish so guys i hope that i made myself clear i will leave it at that and i truly hope it was helpful i'll continue on vimeo see you there if you want to join me the link is below let us know if you resonate leave a comment like share and subscribe to the channel until next time i wish you all the best guys take very good care of you and i will talk to you soon bye